Learn your tables right, 11 to 19. I'm assuming that all of you who are watching this might be familiar or you know might have learned the tables from 1 to 10. That's not a big deal. But when the problem really comes is when you have to learn the tables of let's say 11 uh, to 20. But here as we all know 20 is very easy. So I'm not including 20 here. I'm just stopping it till 19. Okay. It's, it's a very easy technique. For those of you who do not really believe in by hearting things, uh, who like logical approaches to things, and for anyone who is familiar with little uh, addition and multiplication, they can do this very easily. So for the first example, I'm taking 12. That's very easy, right? So 12 into 7. Might seem difficult to predict for those who do not know the table of 12. But if you know the table of 2, you can do this one. How? Let me teach you. Now, 12 into 7. If I take this value, that is 2, and I do 2 into 7, I'll get 14. Okay? Now, I know that 12 is equal to 10 plus 2. So, this 1 needs to be 10 times. So, here, instead of multiplying, I mean, you know, so its value would be, I'll just take it as, you know, for 7 here, I'll just do it, I'll make it 70, because it's 10 times. Okay? Now, what happens that I have got this value. Now, this one comes into action, this is 10 times. So, if it's 10 times bigger, multiply this number with that same number. So, here it's 10. So I get the value at 70. So I have to plus this value, that 70, that will be 4 and 8, 84, which is, I believe, is the right answer. Now, moving on to 13 table. You can use the same thing for, you know, all the rest of the numbers in it. Just remember 2 table and the thing that I tell, told you before. Now 13 table. 13 into 6. Now. What is 3 into 6? 3 into 6 is 18. That same difference is there 10. So from tables 11 to 19, the difference is 10. So don't have to worry about it. Just add a 0 before it. 60 and 80. That will be 78. So 13 into 6 is 78. 14 table. Remember the table of 4 and do the magic. I'm taking a 3 jump. 4 into 3 is 12. This will become 30. So plus 30 to 4. That's 42. Okay. Till now, easy. Now, 15 table. 15 into, let's say, 6. 5 into 6 is 30. 60 that would be 19 and that's right so you have to plus this value now 16 into 7 is how much 6 into 7 is 42 plus 70 that would be 2 11 this is the value now 17 table 7 into 9 is how much difference is 10 so you have to make it 90 now go to 7 table it is 63 as we know that is 7 into 9 is 63 now plus 90 that will be 3 and this will be 153 now 18 table 18 into 8 which seems good so 8 into 8 is 64 plus 80 that will be 4 how much is this? That will be 144. Now last one. 19 into 4. How much is this? This is 36. As we know, 9 into 4 is 36. Plus 50. So that will be 76. Now, you know, be happy because you have learned a new trick and you can use it all the time when you are doing multiple multiplications. Till now, as due to shortage of time, I could do only 11 to 
19. In the next video, I will try to do it after uh, 19, that is 20. And 22, let's say 29. So, I thank you. And thank you for watching. Please like the video and hopefully subscribe to my channel. Thank you.